Hey everybody! Um, you might notice that this video is higher quality than they've been because um, I have a better setup back here and I'm using Windows again, um, going back because I just can't do anything on Linux. I don't know. I don't know, I would like for it to have worked, but uh, I think Skyrim really uh, made the decision for me. I tried getting it to work on Linux and it just wouldn't. Um, I was able to install it and um, sometimes Wine would be able to open it, but uh, nope. But anyway, we have another St. Matthew's Church's letter here to open, so let's open it. Um, February 2016. I think I'm going to get one of these every month. Uh, so, cool. Let's see. Listen with your spiritual ears. Uh, remember these numbers, 33 and 3. They represent three things you are facing, but those are only two numbers. Confidential information enclosed. Oh, this is confidential, guys. As usual, keep this a secret. This is just between me and you. All right. As usual, when I first open the thing, I've got something very eye-catching. So, what is this? It's like a little magazine thing. This is this is a uh, it's a thing. In its way, it's actually fairly nice, you know? It's got nice pictures on it, it's got... It's, it's well made, you know? Um, this is the usual... Um, yeah, dear people whose lives who've been, have been helped, healed, and prospered, write these sweet letters to the church explaining how they've been blessed. Read this amazing letter on how God is blessing this family. And um, here is an amazing letter about how Yahweh is blessing a family because they gave money to St. Matthew's churches. Let's see. Enclosed, please find a United States money order for $1,000. Scriptural seed offering and the balance owed of $77, which is $70. Separate money order. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God made it happen by faith in blah, blah, blah. Um, the people, these people um, sure write very similarly to the people, to like the St. Matthew's Churches people, um, with a lot of um, Bible talk, like, I did this in, uh, uh, in obedience to him that he lay his life down for me that thou may be saved, blah 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 blah, you know, that kind of language. Uh, so, makes me think maybe they are fake. And it, I got this, a little sort of goldish piece of cloth with a little uh, safety pin in there. So it's extra safe. Not sure what he wants me to do with that. And here we have, make sure my address isn't on here, a sealed uh, thing. Um, your sealed prophecy sealed with a sticker. See if I can get this off without ruining it. Nope. Ripped it. I ripped it. I ruined it. Destroyed. Destroyed my prophecy. Dear Heavenly Father, here's a bunch of gobbledygook. People who are as interested in this uh, stuff as I am have seen this kind of thing many times. Um, this is just a lot of empty promises. Uh, the Bible says if you give us money, good things will happen to you and you'll get free stuff. And here's Jesus on there. Yeah. This is your day and time. You only see where you are, but God sees where he is leading you. God chose you to be born and to come into this world for the plan he has for you, for your life and your future. I know that sometimes when things happen, you wonder, why God is this happening to me? No, I never wonder that. Uh, well, further along, we will understand it all. Life is not all lived in one day. Walking by faith is like walking toward the goal with a spiritual flashlight. Okay, so 
we have spiritual ears and there are spiritual flashlights, also known as non-existent. <clears throat> now do not worry, put it in God's hands by faith, our Heavenly Father is in charge. Okay. What else have we got here? What else? There's always a bunch of stuff here. These are, these are like unboxings. Here is something that looks a little bit like the Watchtower, sort of that style, I don't know, something. Maybe it's nothing like the Watchtower and I just said something that makes no sense. There's a mailman giving some mail to a lady. You only see where you are, but God sees where he's leading you. Yeah. And what is this? Oh, this is more, um, more testimonials and more stuff about their seed harvest plan. They're still pushing that. I have mine in the other room. Haven't used it, obviously. Why would I give them money? College. Oh, this one, I don't know why, but this one sort of jumps out at me. The, the Holy Spirit is leading me to, to read this one in purple. Um, Dear St. Matthew's Churches, since joining the Seed Harvest Blessing Plan, many wonderful things have happened to my family and me. My daughter got baptized. How is that wonderful? My husband got a promotion. Okay. And today my son got a semi-scholarship to college. What is a semi-scholarship? Thank you, Jesus. I am so happy. I'm tingly all over. Moving right along, <laughs> we received dot 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 an unexpected financial blessing in brackets um, at this time. I have already mailed in my seed donation for this month. Please continue to pray for us. Pray for my boys and my daughter. My prayer will be for you all. Okay. Well, I read that because I thought maybe someone had donated to them instead of paying for their college. I am so glad I gave you money instead of going to college. But that's not what it was. So, oh well. Here we have the... Uh, deluxe uh, business reply mail with the extra long dealy here with a picture of Jesus on this side. Yeah. These things themselves are like little works of art. Don't you think? I think. Therefore it's true. And last but not least we have the, uh, the letter. I guess this is what I'm supposed to read first. But you know I never do that. I feel the Holy Spirit has witnessed some unprecedented blessing, blessed events coming into your life through your acts of faith. This Jeremiah Numbers 33-3 blessing will affect others connected with you. And if you don't do it, you will all be cursed. No, it doesn't say that, but I don't know. And here we have, return this page in Jesus' name. So here we have the, uh, the gimme, the here's how to give us money page. Yeah. Um, I need this much money to get in good financial shape. <laughs> A billion zillion dollars. Let's see. Yes, I followed the faith instructions with a miracle blessing Bible covenant. I am returning this confirmation letter. Oh yeah, I didn't actually see what they wanted me to do with that little piece of cloth. Um, I might look for that. That might be something. Let's see. <clears throat> something about the 3 and 33. Uh, oh yeah, here we go. My dear friend, uh, in the Holy Spirit, keep this blessed cloth where it is touching your clothing or carry it with you. Print your name, your birthday, and an amount of money you need on this blessed gold cloth and then return it to the church. So it's a gold cloth maybe gold colored but um, and yeah it, it's a it's a wish they're making Yahweh out to be a genie which I personally have no objection to but I know a lot of Christians out there uh, do not take kindly to this sort of twisting of their religion so there you go um, that is this I will catch you next time for the next. I've got several more uh, letters to do. And 